Good morning. It is 9.01 a.m. on Wednesday, December 19th, 2018. I'm Christiana Ellis and I just got up. This is five more minutes. So, uh, yesterday I had a spot of bother. I went to a uh, dinner, holiday dinner sort of mini party for those uh, who work for my company who are in the Boston area and it was a fine evening. But... I determined on my uh, way home that I had a flat tire and uh, almost even more irritating than having a flat tire is that it is one of my front tires of which I replaced both less than a year ago. So that's annoying. But, uh, you know, it's one thing like when a tire just wears out or something, you know, or I, but I don't know, I just feel like, but that was a new one. Eh. Anyway. Uh, so I was able to pull into a, uh, a gas station that had, you know, a uh, uh, not too crowded but well lit, uh, you know, lot uh, where there was room to, you know, change the tire. And it was it was cold out, but you know I was okay. Like I didn't, you know, I I was colder than comfortable, but doing all right. Uh, but it was interesting also just as a coincidence that another guy also with a flat tire pulled in while I was, you know, using the jack to raise the car. And, uh, so it was like, I don't, I don't think that there was anything beyond just pure coincidence to it, but it was, uh, just, it was an interesting coincidence and it, had me thinking because as I was changing the tire, like I was not happy to have to do that, but changing a tire and knowing how to do that and not being, you know, it not being a panic situation, just saying, oh, well, this is inconvenient, but I know what to do. That's something that in the past has given me, you know, personal satisfaction. It's just, it's not a difficult task. I certainly don't want to overblow that, but it's uh, it's not something that is. It's not something that everybody knows how to do. Not everybody has done it before, and so it was just something that when I accomplish it, it just feels like oh, this is this is a thing that I know how to do to take care of myself. I feel, it makes me feel like a grown up, that sort of thing. I believe that the last time I had a flat tire. I said much the similar sentiment and probably I could go back and find out where where in the last year I probably have a video where I was saying the exact same thing. But in addition to feeling that way this time, I actually was able to help this other guy who it, this was his first time trying to change his own tire. And so, uh, you know, I was able to give him those little tips like I think pretty much everyone from logic standpoint, if you know you have the spare, it's like, okay, well, it makes sense. You have to jack up the car. You have to take off the little nut, the lug nuts, swap it out. But just the little things that you don't necessarily think about unless you've been really taught or you've had to do it before, like loosen the lug nuts before you jack up the car, because then if they're too tight and the wheel will spin, it will be difficult to loosen them. So you just do it before you raise the car and things like that. And I, so I was just able to help him out and get him going uh, faster than he probably would have uh, been able to do on his own. And uh, so it was just, it felt good that, you know, our mutual inconvenience uh, was lessened by the fact of the, uh, the two of us being there. And so, I don't know, just the whole thing did kind of make me feel good uh, about all that. Anyway, uh, so many levels returns tonight, and I'm a little bit in a tizzy about it just because I'm trying to decide how to handle it. Because on the one hand, I could really just go very organic with it and not try to push a specific scenario, but it's also going to be the last one that I can probably do for a while because next week I'm returning to Korea and so that just throws my scheduling out. Um, and so, you know, trying to figure out, well, what's the way to make this a big barn buster, you know, uh, 
uh, exciting uh, episode. Well, I'll figure something out. In the meantime, I'll talk to you all tomorrow for five more minutes.